Hi, I'm Jesus, and this is the UMP Moonrise from the Prisma case. It's quite similar to the Glock Moonrise, but in my view, not quite as good still. I have to congratulate the creator on the big bucks he's going to make now that the skin is in the game, and I also want to congratulate him on another aspect of the skin, the secret star pattern. Now, admittedly, it is only secret as long as you don't go to the skin designer's workshop page, but one of the great things about this page is that we can actually see exactly how this pattern works. And I think what this guy's done is really, really clever. So. As you can see, essentially we've got a texture pattern of a cityscape with a moon rising behind it and a weird purple sky. I, I guess those industrial pollutants are getting pretty rad these days. And depending on the pattern index you get, the texture is going to be dragged across the skin to a different position. Now, if we have a look at the texture file, you'll notice a star at the top of the image and we'll invert the color so you can see it a bit easier. But basically, because this star is so high up on the texture file, most of the time, it won't actually show up on the gun, except if it happens to fall on one of the raised points at each end of the weapon. So an instant rare pattern, essentially. I think the way it uses the geometry of the weapon is really clever, and all round, it's just a, a really nice little Easter egg, the sort of detail that I like to see on weapons. But let's cut to the chase. Is this going to be some super special pattern that people overpay for? Now, Obviously, this isn't the first Moonrise skin in the game. As I showed earlier, there's a Glock Moonrise as well, and it's got its own special star pattern too. And believe it or not, these things are actually worth some overpay. As long as the skin doesn't have a terrible wear condition, you can easily get times two or times three overpay for them, which may seem a bit odd considering the blue leaf pattern on the XM1014 Seasons and the red wrap pattern on the MP5 Lab Rat generally aren't worth any overpay, but in reality, it just comes down to the usefulness of the Glock as a weapon. You know, almost everyone uses a Glock, therefore, almost everyone is going to want a Glock skin. And as a result, there's a much larger group of people who'd potentially overpay for a special Glock pattern, as opposed to a weapon like the XM1014 or the MP5. But do keep this in perspective. Times 3 overpay on a non-stat track factory new Glock Moonrise is only about $7.50 US. We're not talking about case hardens here. And with that out of the way, how does this fare for the Moonrise? Well, there is pretty decent demand for UMP skins, you know, maybe less than the Glock, but still more than there is for the MP5 or the XM1014. So this would lend itself to there being some level of overpay for this pattern in the future, less than the Glock, but still some. But there's also another issue. You see, up until this point, I haven't mentioned the odds of getting a star pattern on the UMP, but the weapons creator, has told us exactly what they are. For the Glock, it's 3.75, and for the UMP, it's 8%. And 8% is pretty high for a pattern to command overpay, uh, unless there's something special about the skin. And in fairness to this UMP, it's not a bad skin or a bad gun, but I wouldn't say it's special, and I don't see these things commanding much overpay in the future. So please don't go out and start hoarding these things, especially now while the price is still dropping. You know, it is a nice, cool little pattern, but I don't think it's going to be worth any overpay. Anyway, that's it for this brief little video. If you enjoyed it, please like, comment, subscribe. Otherwise, trust the numbers, not your guts. I'm Jesus. Thanks for watching. See ya.